The world is growing at an exponential rate. Cities are getting bigger and bigger, and the roads are becoming more congested. Incredibly, there are more cars today than ever before. Due to high congestions, people are forced to use public transportation to lighten the load and get faster to their destination. Buses, trains, airplanes, and automobiles are becoming outdated, so in today's video, we are going to see the most futuristic public transportations in the world, so sit back, relax, and enjoy. Uber Elevate Uber is developing a new way of transportation that will change the world. Uber is working with multiple aviation companies to bring this project to reality. Uber Air will be a network of small electric aircraft that will offer rideshare flights throughout the world's largest cities. They are currently working with a prototype called EFTL which stands for Electrical Vertical Takeoff and Landing Vehicle. They plan to use these vehicles to move people all around the city. The Uber Elevate team is working toward transforming the world through aerial ridesharing at scale. Uber aims to make these vehicles quieter, safer, and more affordable than helicopters. Uber Elevate was the main force behind the aggressive target of 2023 for commercial EFTL services. Numerous other aircraft developers including Hyundai, Bell, Jaunt, and Lilium plan for their aircraft to enter into service later in the decade. Uber claims that we can see this type of transportation sooner than we think. Los Angeles, Dallas, and Melbourne will be the three cities to launch the program. To ensure that high safety and sustainability standards are met with this innovative service, the company has partnered with GE Aviation. GE Aviation and Uber Elevate hope that the partnership expands their digital innovation as the travel industry continues to evolve. Moreover, GE's goal is to bring its experience in digital across the travel ecosystem by helping travelers reach their destinations safely and efficiently. The system will work by users ordering an air taxi much in the same way that they would order a traditional Uber. Once the user orders the service, the aircraft will fly to the nearest skyport. The user will board the craft and fly to the closest skyport to their chosen destination. From there, an Uber taxi will be ready to complete the final stages of the journey. Everybody is wondering how much this service will cost. This is still unknown at the moment. We are yet to see whenever Uber releases some approximate cost. Hyperloop Bullet trains have been around for decades. The high-speed trains have been running successfully in more than a dozen countries. But there is a new way to move people faster and more reliable. The Hyperloop is the future of transportation. But what is a Hyperloop? Hyperloop is an ultra-high-speed ground transportation system for passengers and cargo proposed as a concept by Elon Musk, CEO of Tesla and SpaceX. The Hyperloop aims to move passengers traveling at a speed of 700 miles per hour in floating pods through giant low-pressure tubes. The system consists of sealed and partially evacuated tubes, connecting mobility hubs in large metropolitan areas, and pressurized vehicles, usually called pods, which can move at very high speeds, thanks to contactless levitation and propulsion systems as well as to the low aerodynamic drag. Less air means less drag. According to Elon Musk, the Hyperloop can transport people and freight at up to 750 miles per hour, which would make it 2-3x faster than bullet trains. It will have passengers or cargo placed into a floating pod, which would run along inside low-pressure tubes. The Hyperloop tubes could be built either above or below ground. The tubes will be fully autonomous and enclosed to eliminate weather hazards and pilot error. Most of the air is removed from the tubes to minimize friction, which allows the Hyperloop pods to achieve a speed of up to 750 miles per hour. The pods won't have wheels like cars or conventional trains. They will float in the low-pressure tube using magnetic levitation. Several Hyperloop routes have been proposed including New York to Washington DC, Kansas City to St. Louis, and many more. Skytran Skytran is a personal rapid transit system concept first proposed by inventor Douglas Malawicki in 1990. It is a driverless pod, gliding above city streets, using a network of elevated guideways. 
Public transport as we know it requires stops. Skytran is different. A Skytran vehicle only stops at your chosen destination. Bypassing stations along the way, you travel at high speed for the duration of your trip. This is the very definition of seamless point-to-point -point travel. By giving you the option to bypass stations along the way, users of Skytran can travel at high speeds for the duration of their trip. Passengers will only slow down when it is time to pull into their chosen stopping point. Skytran says the technology uses only a third of the electricity used by one of today's hybrid cars, because its vehicles weigh just 300 pounds. It is ultra lightweight. The system works with magnetic levitation technology. Maglev is a system of train transportation that uses two sets of magnets, one set to repel and push the train up off the track, and another set to move the elevated train ahead, taking advantage of the lack of friction. Because there are no contact points between the pods and the rail, there is little or no friction, meaning it is a very efficient means of transportation. The Skytrend network is set to be entirely computer controlled. This system will work like Uber, users of this system will be able to order a pod to a specific location for a certain time. Once on board, the pod will recognize the Skytran cards of the user, and it will queue up music or movies so that the user can have a great time while traveling. Ali 2.0 Ali 2.0 is the future of transportation. This is one of the electric autonomous shuttles that has impressed the world with their level 4 autonomous capability system. The tall rectangular pod, with its wide-set headlights and expansive windows nestled between a rounded frame, gives the shuttle a friendly countenance that screams, ever so gently, come along, take a ride. But Ali is different in almost every way, from how it's produced to its origin story. And now, its maker, Local Motors, has given Ali an upgrade in hopes of accelerating the adoption of its autonomous shuttles. Ali.0 has a lot more range up to 100 miles on a single charge, according to its spec sheet. The manufacturing process has been improved, and Ali is now 80% 3D printed, and has hub motors versus the axle wheel motors in its predecessor. Besides, there are two more seats in Ali and new programmable lighting. But where Ali.0 really stands out is in the improved user interface, and more choices for customers looking to customize the shuttle to suit specific needs. The Ali is now part of the Jacksonville Transportation Authority's JTA, Ultimate Urban Circulator U2C, program, marking the first deployment of the autonomous shuttle in the U.S. Ali features technology to provide driver warning, driver assist, and connected autonomous functionality in urban, mixed traffic roadways and campus environments. PAL-V Liberty the PAL V Liberty is one of the most advanced pieces of technology of this century, and the most futuristic one. The PAL V Liberty is a three-wheel car that has one very impressive feature that makes it different from everything that we have seen. Inspired by nature, engineered by man, and evolved over time, the PAL V Liberty is a groundbreaking product that inaugurates the age of the flying car. The PAL V Liberty is a marriage between safety and fun, designed to satisfy the most demanding customers. Just by looking you can tell what this car is all about. It is hard not to notice the massive propellers that make this car a flying car. Well, it is not fully a driving car, it is more like a hybrid flying machine. The PAL V Liberty compact design allows you to drive the car like any other vehicle, but with one push of a button, the car will allow you to fly. It is incredible. It is a car that flies and a plane that drives. This is the selling point without a doubt. Besides its incredible flying feature, the plane looks and feels great. You are not just buying an incredible piece of technology that has pushed the boundaries of innovation, but you are also getting a luxury feel of a vehicle. Leather interior and carbon fiber are just the start when talking about comfort and feel. I mean, with a $400,000 price tag you would not expect less. This is not a concept car. In fact, it is a fully functional unit that works like any other real vehicle. The Pioneer Edition is for those that want to be part of the new segment of cars that will write history. There are 90 available units that will launch in 2021. Let us know if you are interested in more content like this one.
Do not forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on your notification. Thanks for watching. We will see you in the next videos.